Hi guys, Michelle Ray here. And uh, I'm shooting this video because um, there's so much going on. And last night um, I was watching Oliver Stone, uh, his interview with uh, Russia's president, Putin. And um, basically what I got from it was that he in no way or anybody in his administration hacked the, anything of the United States, anything to do with the election, nothing. That and um, basically what he said was that there are 80,000 terrorists that are fighting for the oil over there. That's what it's all about. It's about control and controlling the oil because he who has the most oil has the most power because that is a major source of energy. Um, that and uh, the reason why you're seeing so many attacks on, you know, on all these countries is because the heads of states are funding ISIS. They're funding ISIS to create uh, a situation in which like martial law can be put in place and this way they have complete control over everything they're trying to get it so you have to rent homes from them um, rent cars basically be enslaved you'll have the rich 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 and the poor really really poor and um, and they're all in on in on it except for guess who Donald Trump and uh, President Putin, which is why those two people are being completely destroyed in any every possible way at, in doing whatever they can possibly do. Um, Oliver Stone's interview, um, he said, Putin said that um, in the airspace over uh, Syria or Libya, Syria, um, that Australian has fighter jets, United States, uh, you, um, England, um, uh, Saudi Arabia, um, not Iran, um, or not Israel, and not Iran, but um, yeah, pretty much everybody, which goes to show you that that's why they're letting in these people, because they're actually mercenaries and they're funding them to create a situation to put everybody in complete and utter fear and um, and put in place what everybody's calling a new world order. So check it out. I'm sure they'll air it again. HBO, um, the Putin interview with Oliver Stone. It's a four-part series, and it was very, very... Basically what Putin had said too was that he doesn't care what anybody thinks, he doesn't care what anybody says or does, um, as long as it doesn't interfere with what he's doing, as long as they don't, you know, mess with him. You know, he just, he wants to do right by the people, he's for the people, he's, he loves his country, and his, the, the, the um, people love him, they absolutely love him, they have really he has really brought a lot of change over there and he seems very sincere and uh yeah i'm sure that he's got something up his sleeve that if anybody really crosses the line they're going to be sorry because he seems he seemed very relaxed very as a matter of fact like you know it is what it is you know we'll protect our we will protect our country and fight to the death basically so and you know Clinton gave them how much uranium? Hello. Yep, and so that's the that's the deal. Um, deface them, de um, you know, trash them at every cost, and uh, there you have it.